Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. So, um, someone asked me to try a tree ring pour with a square and with a triangle. I already did the square. If you did not see that one yet, I'll post the link in the description so you can check it out. And today we're going to try the triangle. And just to make this easy, I'm using my split cup here. This is, I call it a triple split cup because it has three splits. For some people that's confusing, so if you want, you can call it a four compartment split cup. But it should make doing this tree ring super easy. And I'm using um, a pretty fun color combination. The white is Artist Law Flow Acrylics and the rest are Porage Posse paints. And those are the paints that Christina Welch sells in her Etsy store. So I'll put all those down in the description. All right, so basically I'm gonna try to go in a triangle. Easier said than done sometimes. And we're gonna see the difference between this and the square or a circle. So I'm gonna take my time doing this, go slow. I'll go ahead and speed this part up and I'm just doing my best. It doesn't always come out super smooth. So it might not always be a triangle, but I'll do my best. All right, so we definitely have a triangle here. I got better as I went. So I'm going to try to tilt towards the corners of that triangle which should be interesting since one of the corners is kind of in the middle. Let's go ahead and go to that corner. And then we'll bring it back and then we're going to bring it straight this way. All right. I don't know how I'll get those other corners covered if I only go towards those so I'm going to tilt a little bit off to the side here but still trying to maintain that triangle as much as possible. Um, I definitely see that triangle shape here and if you guys didn't see that square definitely check it out that's like one of my favorite paintings for quite a while although I am definitely loving how this one is coming out it seems like we're gonna lose most of that pink and we're gonna be left with that the blues and the greens which is okay with me I did put the pink on the very top so coming out last it's kind of guaranteed to get mostly run off the canvas I do have other requests, guys, which I will be fulfilling. Um, one for uh, trying to do a star and another one for trying to do a heart. So I'll try those. A star sounds like, <laughs> like a difficult task, but might be able to. So I think I still see the triangle. Let me know what you guys think. But let me go ahead. I'll let this sit here for a little while. And then I'll bring you guys all in for a close-up. All right, we're back. Actually, some fun little reactions in here. I kind of like this one. So let's go ahead and do our close-up. So lower right-hand corner. Love this color combination. Coming up to the upper right-hand corner. Upper left-hand corner. And down to the lower left hand corner. And then in the middle, where you can still kind of see the triangle in there. So let me know what you guys think. Can you tell the difference between the triangle, the square, and the circle? It's definitely fun, at least if anything. And check down in the description for all the materials, including the link to my new split cup and the link to these Porage Posse paints. 
and I will see you all next time.